This video will highlight the Tecla TED's steel column design calculation to the Euro code. Before running any calculation within the library, always read the associated notes which cover the scope, important assumptions and limitations and references. Examples are provided within the library. These can also be used as a starting point for your own designs. The input parameters covered the design loading, column geometry, column details, national annex and output. Preview results are displayed. Design loading sets the ultimate loads. Axial load can be either tension, or compression. Bending moments for the top and bottom of the column and the major and the minor shear force to be considered, are also specified. Additional information is available where you see an information symbol. Column geometry sets the buckling lengths. For flexural buckling these can be input directly or calculated from end-restrained factors. The buckling length button then allows you to specify the input for the chosen method. A third calculation method is available, from frame geometry, which is applicable to rigid jointed frames. The method allows you to define the stiffness of the various parts of the frame to calculate the buckling length in accordance with SN008. The buckling length values used for design are reported. Further factors are specified for torsional buckling and lateral torsional buckling. You can specify if the column forms part of a sway frame in the major and or minor axis. Column details allow you to specify the section type to consider. These can be I, H, C, RHS or CHS section types. The steel grade can be selected, or a user-defined value can be set. You specify the national annex upon which the design is to be based. Preview results are shown for each design check along with a utilization and a pass or fail status. If anything fails, the failures can be reviewed and amendments made to the input. Once you are satisfied with the input and preview results, you can specify the output options including the level of detail and whether to include a cross-section sketch. Confirm the information and your design and the calculation output is written to the document. The calculation title, sketch if requested, input geometry, steel properties, loading details and the design calculation checks are all laid out in a clear and concise format.